Hi guys, so today I'm gonna do something super exciting. I'm gonna be going to see my husband, Simu Liu. Hi Simu, if you're watching this, just kidding. Yeah, I am a big fan of Simu, not because, not like a fan in that kind of way, I'm just a big fan of his work. I've been um, watching him since, you know, a long time because I've always been on YouTube and stuff. So yeah, I'm just getting ready to go. Actually, I kind of don't know about this outfit because I feel like the top and the pants don't really fit that well. The pants are giving corporate and the top is giving summer spring, but it's okay. I don't really want to wear like a skirt or something because it is not that hot just yet. So I feel like it's not weather appropriate. So this will just have to do. I feel like it's fine. It doesn't matter that much. I'm just going to change my earrings. Ta-da! Look how pretty they are. I love them. Um, yeah, they look great with this top. The pants are, you know, not as cute as I'd like them to be. I don't have any cream. Actually, I do. Do I want to wear them is a question. Oh wait, no, they're in the washing, okay? I just have to, I just have to go with black, it's fine. We're waiting for Simu. Standing here and being like, friends, <laughs> Romans, countrymen, <laughs> lend me your ears. Good morning, guys. So today I am going to get my hair done. Woo! Now, I do my hair like once a year. Ah, too much, too much, too much. Get back in there. Oh yeah, okay. I'm gonna do a quick ab workout right now before I head out uh, and maybe try to do one of those arm workouts as well, but um, if I have time because I'm running a little bit late, but yeah, I'm gonna do a quick ab workout. I've been doing them every morning. So I just finished my workout. And today, I'm actually gonna go get my hair re-dyed. So that's exciting. I am gonna get it retouched. You can see here, the ends are, it's like from this angle, my hair just looks black again. But I really wanna re-dye it to this color, maybe a little bit lighter. And once a year, I retouch my hair. I've been doing this for like the past three years now. Or yeah, the past three years now. And every time I redo my hair, I actually feel like I'm reborn like my alter ego just comes out and flourishes and I feel like I am at my best like at my peak self when I get my hair redyed like freshly redyed so I'm really really excited for that hopefully it will look good I've been to this person before so I expect it to be similar to last time so it's fine and I also want to get it cut so it's really long and honestly I would keep the length if I could but it's just too dead and the ends definitely need to be trimmed so I think I'm gonna get a small haircut and while I'm at it I thought I'd probably try like some layered cuts like long layers and maybe some curtain bangs as well but we'll see about that I am so excited because doing my hair is kind of part of like a wider holiday prep routine that I've got going on right now so I am going full out as i always do whenever i go on a big holiday so every time i go to asia or something i like to like go full on prep so last time i well actually the first time i dyed my hair and went like full abg mode and i made a video about it that's actually the first video i ever made and that was before i had a proper channel like that's just a video that i decided to make for fun but that was before an asia trip as well so that year we went to korea japan and Taiwan and this year we're going to go to Singapore and Malaysia so of course doing the whole holiday prep thing again I'm gonna get my eyelashes done and I'm gonna get my nails done obviously doing my hair today and yeah I literally gonna go full out and I feel like I generally feel like I, I, I always look the best when I'm on holiday which is kind of ironic because you're really not on holiday that much right you're on holiday for like a few 
weeks a year and then the rest of the weeks in the year you don't look your best i don't i just feel the best when i'm on holiday as well so like i put in so much effort into just making sure that i feel good which is important to be honest so i'm super excited for this holiday and yeah i even bought like summer clothes i've got all my holiday prep ready and now just gotta just gotta get on the plane really and we're flying out next week which came along super quickly this was a very spontaneous trip by the way anyways i'm just gonna quickly finish off my makeup and head to lunch i think i might bring my laptop with me when i go to do my hair because i'm gonna be there for hours i might as well edit while i'm there so i'll let you guys know i'll take you guys along so i vlog the day hidden gem in Canary Wharf. Actually, it's not really that hidden. I feel like everyone who works here or who comes here often knows about it. But if you don't know about it, then yeah, if you just come to the Crossrail place in Canary Wharf, they have this really pretty garden up here. So I'll just walk around until my friend gets here. home for a few hours now and here is my new hair color I I basically filmed a video of me coming back home and I was at the time freaking out about my hair because a lot of it had fallen out and I was just not feeling the best about it but now that it's been a few hours I actually quite like it so I thought to refilm my um, after video I guess so yeah this is what it looks like at the moment the the hair style um in terms of like the curls is not very me so please ignore the curls i feel like they're just tighter than i would usually make them and also because i lost so much hair basically a lot of my hair fell off because of the bleaching it might have just been the fact that i just bleached a lot of it and you know well can't do anything about it now but a lot of my hair fell out which i was very unhappy about but that's just it happens it happens hair grows out you know i moved on now it's been a few hours and i'm fine with it now it just looks very thin and sparse here at the end it looks like i don't have much of it, it which i don't like i feel like i have ha legitimately i'm not even saying this as a hyperbole i actually have about half of the hair i used to have when it comes to volume and just amount of hair because so much hair fell out like when it was wet i would run my fingers through it just to see what happened and like just strands of hair would come out and now that it's dry it's fine but i'm gonna have to be incredibly incredibly careful when i wash it and overall the curtain bangs they look good i feel like right now my hair isn't styled my preferred way so i feel like i felt a little bit more unfamiliar with it as well so i was really freaking out but i actually quite like the color now it's settled on me i've definitely like I feel more comfortable with it now and I feel like I just need to restyle my hair so that the curls are a bit wider and a bit more towards my liking but yeah I'm definitely still trying to get used to the curtain bangs I think they look good I just I'm not used to it and so like I, I have this like thing blocking my vision and I don't know how to manage that overall I think I have a positive sentiment now in the beginning I, I was freaking out definitely did not have a positive sentiment about it earlier now I do I just I just kind of wish I didn't lose so much hair. Honestly, at the end of the day, a little bit of hair fell out. Sure, I have less hair. That's fine. The color is great. I still like it. I still have hair in my head. Life goes on. Hair is one of those things that grows out. So there's no reason for you to freak out. And I'm sure that once I style it and stuff like that, I'll be happy. So yeah, I'm happy to be blonde. And I, I'm feeling this color. I'm feeling the color for the summer. So yeah. Heather and I are going to get our nails. It's my secret Santa present. <laughs> She's taking off her nails now. What's the current color you have? It's like a lilac color. It's quite pretty. Yeah. Mine it's are a bit grown out. As you can tell. So I'm going to refresh them and do something more summery. This okay. is the inspo picture. We just did our nails, so pastel and flowery 
lilac vibes. Not sure my toes. No, no toes. <laughs> no free toes. 